Hi guys, it's Dr. Veronica Vax and today I'm going to talk about drinking water 10 minutes before the meal. Drink water and create acid reflex. Somehow my video on the topic drinking water before the meal and right after the meal 30 or 40 minutes will create a gourd. This video created a lot of discussion and people asking questions. One of my sub subscribers did his research and he writes to me. I learned that water will stay in the empty stomach for about 10 minutes. After that, it will move to small intestine. After 10 minutes, it will have no impact on pH of the stomach whatsoever. So result, I can drink water 10 minutes before, before the meal. And my answer to you is, yes, it's a kind of, you're correct about stomach but there is more to understand about pH and pillarus. So let's go to explanation. You have to remember rule of physiology. Pillarus opens when pH in the stomach is about 2 and pH of the small intestine is about 7. So let's go to the blackboard and I will explain you why I say that you cannot drink 10 minutes before the meal. Here I already pre-draw the picture of the digestive tract for us. Here is the mouth with the teeth, esophagus, this is the stomach, Small and excuse me, low esophageal sphincter here, pillarus is here, small intestine goes down there. This is the liver, and the liver will produce bile and it will come into small intestine. P stays for pancreas and it will produce pancreatic enzymes. So, suppose you decided that you are going to drink uh, a lot of water 10 minutes before the meal. So, here is the water that you are going to have. It will end up here in the stomach and 10 minutes later it will be out of the stomach and it will go into small intestine. Now you are ready to, to eat your meal. Here is your food coming in. It will drop here into the stomach and at that time you will start to produce hydrochloric acid to create pH 2. At the same time, exactly at the same time, there are local mechanisms that will send the signal to the liver and to the pancreas, start to produce bile and start to produce pancreatic enzymes because we need to create pH 7 in the small intestine. However, as you start to produce bile and pancreatic enzymes, a lot of water is coming through the small intestine and what happens, it will wash away those pancreatic enzymes and the bile. As a result, you are not going to create adequate pH here below pillarus. Let me draw pillarus red. Okay, so pH here in the small intestine is not going to be 7. As a result, pillarus will remain close. As a result, food will stay here longer than it's supposed to be in the stomach. As a result, it will have a chance to go through low esophageal sphincter into the uh, esophagus and create acid reflex there. So I hope guys the concept is clear. If you have any questions, please ask me. I also created a course how to cure good. Please check it. For now, thank you very much. Please ask questions. Subscribe. It's Dr. Veronica. Bye-bye.